Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, my name is Rosie and I invite you to subscribe to the channel for everything beauty, style, and food in a vegan way. And today it's going to be more on the business side because I get asked often, how do I generate money working from home? So here I'm going to talk about five ways that I make money with real examples. That way you get a better idea or you're just curious to know how maybe you can start applying some of these things with your own brand or business. So without talking anymore, let's begin. Okay guys, so I want to start by mentioning that the content that you guys see here, whether it's video or it's a blog post, it can just take minutes, a few minutes to just see it, but all the work that goes behind it can take hours. So I want to start mentioning that because I don't want to give you the idea that to get to this point, it's all easy. I've been doing this for a while, so it did take me work to get to this point. And the other thing that I make it work for me is that I schedule everything. So everything that I do, I do it in bulk. So let's say one day, for example, today is just my filming day. So I film two videos, but for me it equals four videos because it's English and Spanish. And then let's say tomorrow I'll just do editing. The following day we'll just be writing blog posts. And just like that, like each day I focus on one task. Whereas before, maybe one day I would do many things in one day. And I see that doing it this way, I am more focused and I am more productive. So that's why I do it this way. And the other thing about implementing the things I'm going to mention here is that you have to think outside of the box. So what you can apply in one platform, you can apply it in maybe two or the other ones that you have. So right now, everything that I do from home, it's kind of like a part-time job for me. So one of the ways that I make money online is using affiliate links. And maybe you are familiar with this. So basically, if you're not, basically what this means is that every time you do a blog post or a video and you recommend some products to your viewers or your readers, then you get a percentage back of that sale. A lot of the things that you see on my blog post or in the description, box of the videos I'm linking let's say for example a book that I really like and I recommend it to you guys then I will use my affiliate link and that way the person who's buying it they don't even have to pay extra for that you're just making a commission a percentage of that sale so you're kind of like the salesperson and this is a great way because a lot of shoppers already buy from Amazon. So they really trust Amazon. And of course, even I shop from Amazon all the time. So that's why I thought, why not become an affiliate for Amazon and recommend the products that you already use? So that's a great way. But the percentages are different depending on the category. I know for beauty, um, it's a little bit more and even fashion, even electronics, I believe it's a higher percentage. I don't know it by memory. If you look it up on Google, they have a guide and that way you know exactly what each category pays. And a few other examples that you can use apart from Amazon, another one that I use is ShareSell. I'm also a member of Rakuten and Awin. I hope I'm saying that right. So to give you an example, all the links, well most, most of the links on my resources page where I talk about books that I recommend, the camera equipment that I use, a lot of those links are directed towards Amazon and those are my affiliate links. Okay, another way that I make money is using Ebates. So this kind of works similar to Amazon, but it's a little bit different. So yes, one, you can make commission if you recommend it to them and that person makes a purchase, but you also make commission when you buy something. So you're making double commission with Ebates, whereas with Amazon, you only make a commission if somebody buys something. So this is what I like about Ebates is that you can double make commission and depending on the store where you shop from. So every store has a different percentage that you can get back as cash back. And you can even install the plugin to your browser depending if you have Firefox, Google Chrome, etc. And I already made a detailed video on this in case you guys want to check it out and see how I use it, then I'm going to link that up for you. And by the way, from what I've heard and what I've read is that 
Ebates is no longer going to be called Ebates, but Rakuten. So you're going to be changing their name and all their logos. That's what I've heard. <laughs> Just to give you an idea on how much I've made, this is a screenshot from my account and you can see how much I have earned so far. Okay, this is something you need to have if you are more into fashion and sharing outfits and maybe you already have it by now. And it's called Shop Style Collective. So basically when you have an outfit, you can find everything that you're wearing or find similar pieces and recommend it. So this is super similar to Amazon affiliates where basically you are using affiliate links as well and the links you just grab it and you can just share that on your blog YouTube on your Instagram basically as long as you have the link you can share that wherever you like and another similar website is reward style but they are more picky i didn't get accepted to reward style that's why i'm using shop style they're more picky they do go through your account or blog or instagram and they want to see like really good quality photos so if you want to apply for a reward style you have to impress them with your photos basically and to give you an idea, whenever I do a blog post with an outfit, then the links that you see there are affiliate links, but with shop style. And so basically what I do, I just add my photos and underneath I will add text and the text converted into links. And the other way is that I add a product widget so it's also clickable. Okay, so the fourth way is as you can see here with this video, YouTube. So basically, as long as you feel comfortable being in front of the camera and talking about something, if you have your niche, then you're good to go. But I've also seen some YouTube channels where they never show their face. It could be like nail tutorials or people who fix up electronics. It could be anything. And those people also generate money. So once you have your YouTube account, just make sure to monetize it so that means that you have to sign up with google adsense create an account and that will be connected to your channel and as far as how often you should post every channel is different some people say that you should be putting out about two videos per week and some channels i've seen they only post a few times a year and it goes really well for them so every channel is different i think it all depends on the type of content in my personal experience when i was posting more regularly my income was a little bit higher and now that i stopped posting videos i still generate money but not as much so every channel is different okay and the fifth and last way would be sponsored posts so at this point i get emails every week from brands that want to work with me but i don't always accept it it all depends on the type of product if it aligns with my lifestyle if maybe we negotiate on a price so at this point i have a really good idea on what i can charge on the size of my platform but to give you an idea let's say it's instagram for every a thousand followers that you have you can start charging 25 so let's say you have 1k followers then you can charge 25 2k followers then 50 dollars 3k followers around 75 and so on but brands not only look at that they also look if your followers are engaging with your content so are they liking are they leaving comments and things like that they look at everything and another thing you also want to start negotiating with brands let's say they give you a price you want to go a little bit higher than what they offer and in the beginning it might feel uncomfortable but the more you do it the more comfortable you feel and at this point because i know what i offer all the time that i put into it and the quality i feel comfortable knowing what to charge in my case so to give you an example you can check out my press page and basically it's a list of brands that i have worked with with examples this is the same link that i sent to brands that are reaching out to me and that way they get to see exactly what i can offer if they like the content that i create well guys these are five ways to generate money 
whether you are into blogging or YouTube to give you guys an idea or maybe if you guys were just curious. So now I'm curious to know if you guys are doing any of these things or what do you guys do as a living. You can let me know in the comments section and I invite you to subscribe to the channel and to follow me on all social media pages with the same name, Lynn Sire. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Kisses! Bye!